it's fun to be able to delve in the psyche of a, of a character. Just that challenge of, of finding what makes people tick. My mother is uh, 85. She went skydiving this summer <laughs> at 85. <laughs> She raised us to never want for something without reaching for it. If you wanted to do something, as long as you were educated in it, you could do it. Uh, so I grew up with a lot of encouragement. It, it never occurred to me that anything I wanted to do, I could not do it. I was at Indiana University at the time. I was a stage manager. And the girl that they had hired to do the lead was not very good. And so they let her go. And I said, I can do it. And I had to play an older woman. And, uh, and I loved it, being on stage and having, being focused and everybody's working together. You know that they lived that moment. Um, you know they're afraid of a mo you, it's you can feel it it's tangible but it was that play that really sort of sent me over and made me realize wow I like doing this I had an agent who said look you've been out on the road I've been doing a lot of theater out on the road and he said you know take this thing it's not gonna last a year <laughs> I had no idea that the character would, or the show would last that long. The show did 20 seasons and I did 16 of the 20. I think the joy of it for me is no matter where I go, there are people that loved Van Buren. And I see police officers who yell out, Lou, hey Lou, I love that. <laughs> That's the biggest compliment you can get. I knew all along that I wanted to get on the other side of the camera. And so our documentary now, The Contradictions of Fair Hope, is a call to action within our community. There's a lot about our history we don't know. And we need to start asking questions because there's a disconnect. And I think the disconnect is not uh, just in the black community. I think it's universal. It, it's amazing the things that we don't know. And if we don't ask, we'll never find out.